like the Greek gods. Fire to those first graders. <laughs> I have heard much about 
you, Percy Jackson. Really? That's like very dedicated for a substitute. Kicked out of five schools in six years. What well, might question your parents Hey, don't talk about my mom. And your father. Oh, that's right. You don't know who he is. I can't even know that anyway.
creative writing night classes. <laughs> and I'm doing you a favor. That's a waste of money anyway. He was my kid. I'm not. Lucky for him. Bean dip. <laughs> Man, I think I ever heard of showers. Um, you do not have to put up with him like that. It's complicated. Person. Yeah, I know you always say that, but why? Because the truth might mean saying goodbye to you for good. <sighs> Maybe it's time. I can't tell you all my secrets. Maybe you should start with one. I'll show you where I met your dad. He be proud of his son. Who cares? We're better off without him. No, it's time you found out more about him. Oh, look at the size of those waves. Fire's going, and someone needs a marshmallow. And they're blue. <laughs> Don't tell me you're too old for blue food. So you met Dad on this beach. I first saw him in the water, coming out of the morning mist. He was handsome, strong, and before too long, he came to exist. And then he ditched us. No coming home for dinner. He sounds like a real winner. He didn't have a choice. He wanted to meet you, and he warned me things might be hard for you if you were like him. Oh, was he a screw up too? Sorry, Mom. I was only normal. Hey, blue food isn't normal. Blue food is strange. And that's why it's my favorite. I never want to change. To make it boring or to read.
You didn't tell her about the field trip? What happened on the field trip? You told me it didn't matter. He met a fury. Yeah, you're all furry. What happened to your legs? <laughs> I'm a satyr. I'm half goat. Wait, you're going to mention this like a little sooner? No, Trover. Is a fury after Percy right now? A uh, fury? No, 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 no. Thank God. It's a minotaur. What's a minotaur? Oh, half full. Like you? I'm half goat. Wait, I'm sorry. This is a lot for me to take in right now. Boys. Grover, you need to get Percy to the border. What about you? You're the one that's after Percy. I love you so much. Did you just say that you are a god? 
Dionysus got a wine. The gods are real, yippee skippy. Yeah, Katie Gardner, I see you've injured your arm. I fell off the Pegasus. You don't have flying lessons on Thursdays, you have archery. Those arrows are made of wood. Wood comes from trees. I refuse to participate in any activity that encourages the senseless slaughter of our arboreal friends. Oh God, here we go with all This guy is saying all this crazy stuff about nymphs and gods and what is going on? It's complicated. Okay, if you have no idea about this place or your former mentor, I don't have time to fill you in on the details. But look, he's also a centaur. I did He can be a bit... Well, he hates children. <laughs> I thought you were a Latin teacher. <laughs> More like ancient Greek. My true name is Chiron, and my real job is training demigods, half gloves, like you. Wait, so you're saying that all that crazy stuff that that guy just said, it's all true? You think the Greek gods stopped existing? just because people stopped believing in them. They're all around us, and so are their children. Okay, but I'm not, so... <coughs> okay, this has to be a big mistake. I'm gonna get my mom, she's gonna clear this up and... Uh... Where is my mom? Grover said she fought bravely. An immortal woman against a minotaur. That wasn't a dream. She's like really gone. I am so sorry, Percy. No, but it's all my fault. She was trying to protect me. No, you mustn't blame yourself. So if you say that the gods are real, how could they even let that happen? I'm afraid there are some questions only the gods themselves can answer. Look for their sign. You have to be patient. A sign that the gods have a plan. I know that the future looks blurry, but not to worry, just do what you can. Yes, the gods are very real, though they often won't reveal who they are, what they want, their desires. Have faith, keep your chin up, we'll help you adjust, and trust you'll see their side. So my dad is a guy, I'd like to know which one. He's got a lot to answer for. He showed no sign that he ever no sign he might actually care. My mom breaks me all on her lonesome when I reach out. No one else would be there. Well, I want my birthday card to be changed. Shout some more to no more tips from me to for wine. The guy didn't need to be dad of the year, but clear he could have shown us a sign. So who is he? It could be, that is to say, the prophecy suggests. But that's impossible. See you dinner, Percy. Tough <laughs> first day. For this morning, I didn't believe in any of this. Uh, believing doesn't make it easier, trust me. After all this time, I just thought my dad was so deadbeat. It turned out he's, he's a deadbeat girl. <laughs> yes. I get how you feel. I was 
your age when I found out my dad was Hermes, the messenger god, you know, old wings on his shoes. Have you ever met him? I once. And we're not playing catch anytime soon. Look, the gods, they're busy, okay? They have a lot of kids. They don't always care. If you're one of the lucky ones, they'll send a sign. They want to claim you a sign to admit you're their own. If they don't, then no one can blame you for holding grudge. So hey, you're not alone. I'm Luke. I'm gonna be your counselor. The Hermes cabin takes anyone who hasn't been claimed. You know what that means? We are literally the reject cabin. Welcome to the dysfunctional family. Hey, rejects, stick together. Oh, besides, there's someone who's been waiting to see you. I'm sorry. Satyrs are supposed to be protectors. I'm the worst satyr in the world. Robert, I am so glad that you are here. <laughs> when parents are distant, they're seen on existence. Hang on. survived a minotaur. Well, you don't believe him? He shows up out of nowhere, says he doesn't know anything about us, but he's strong enough to fight a minotaur? Something doesn't add up. I just can't figure out what. Yeah, well, this man the best chase can I'm the smartest person you know. Yeah, you're also the toughest. I'd admit it either way. You think I'm tough? Um, I mean, uh, how do you think he's a cat for the flag? You know? Capture the flag! Yeah! What is going on? And are you ever going to wear pants again? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. You are going to need this. Uh, a sword? Yeah. Have you ever played Capture the Flag before? Uh, not with a sword. <laughs> hey. <clears throat> It's not a lightsaber. You're my dream girl. <laughs> I mean, uh, the girl that I met while I was dreaming. Are you sure he doesn't have a concussion? This is Annabeth. Our cabins are on the same team. You see, cabins, they're grouped by parents. Each cabin has certain gifts. So I figure if we find out what you're good at, that'll give us a clue about your dad. Oh, but I don't have any gifts. Uh, you have ADHD, right? Dyslexia, too? Yeah. Okay, but... letters float off the page when you read because your mind is hardwired for ancient Greek. And the ADHD, you're impulsive, you can't sit still in class. Those are your battlefield reflexes. So who's your dad? He's a history professor. Oh, he's human. I thought that My mom point. is Athena, goddess of wisdom. Sexist much? No, I love girls. <laughs> I think they're very nice. <laughs> Capture the flag isn't about being nice. It's about proving to the gods that we're tough, powerful, and victorious in battle. Okay, she's a little intense. <laughs> you should see the captain of the other team. Who's the captain of the other team? I am! Meet Clarice, daughter of Ares, the god of war.
feel like that's a stereotype. What brigade of goblins? Hey, Grover! Huh? Satyrs are creatures of Pan, gods of the wild. Do you know what to do? We all hide in the tree! Oh, what about me? I don't know my talent yet. Oh, I have a special job for you. Go to the boys' bathroom. And? Stay there. Yeah. It's your first day. We don't want you messing this up. <laughs> Surprise! Oh no! Oh no! And I sat by. 
son of the sea god, Poseidon. My dad is Poseidon. <laughs> oh, sweet!
Hades, the treacherous lord. That's got him in Hades, right? Why Hades? The underworld is in Los Angeles. <laughs> Actually, I am not surprised. Hades has always been jealous of his brothers, and with each new war, his own kingdom expands. If he stole the bull to incite a war between Zeus and Poseidon, we have to stop him. And I'm afraid by we, I mean you. Why, a hero's quest? It's only the biggest honor a half-blood can get. Uh, Annabeth is right, your dad. He needs a hero to clear his name. His quest could be the whole reason he claimed you. Because he needs me. Well, where was he when I got kicked out of school? And when we couldn't pay rent? Oh, my mom just... No, forget it. I'm staying here. Oh, I'm afraid that's not an option. <laughs> what? Mr. D was right. As long as you're here, Zeus will punish the entire camp. Which means... You're expelling me? <laughs> Again? <laughs> that's not fair. I wish there was another way. Once again, Percy. I'm truly sorry. Six schools in six years, been kicked down in every place. Everything I ever do is wrong, never find where I belong. Everybody on my case. The same old story, the same old song. Don't act up, don't act out, be strong. Keep my head down, I keep my chin up, but it ends up all the same. With back your back, mercy, you're always playing. I never try to do anything, I never need to hurt anyone. I try and try to be a good kid, a good kid, a good son. Poseidon, and do you want to be alone? 
Don't go to the lake. <laughs> First place to look. Don't worry, I won't tell Kyron you're here. Look at the waves. It's like the sea and the sky are fighting. Uh, yeah, <laughs> they are. You know the gods when they're mad, they like everyone to know. You know I went on a quest. Yeah. Last summer, my dad, he told me to steal a golden apple from some garden. It wasn't important. The world wasn't at stake. Who knows? Maybe he thought it would be fun to watch. Or he had a craving for apples. Anyway, I got the apple, but there was a dragon guarding it. So I also got this scar. That's when I realized the gods, they don't care about us or if we get hurt. So I get it, if it were my dad, I wouldn't go either. It's not even just that. The Oracle told me that I would be betrayed by a friend, and that even if I find the bolt, I would fail. <laughs> hey, that's pretty good for the Oracle. Look, <laughs> prophecies, they're weird. Okay, they don't always mean what you think they do. And I'm not gonna say you owe your dad anything. You don't. But, what about your mom? My mom is gone. Yeah, from this world, but if she's anywhere, she'd be in the, the underworld. Yeah, I'll do it. Not cause my dad needs me. He's been less a dad and more absentee. But if my mom's alive, that's where she's bound to be. I'm leaving now, I better pack. If you took my mom, I'm taking her back. So what if no one's come back from the underworld? I will be the first. And I'll be the second first. No, Robert, I cannot ask you to come. You're my best friend, dude. So don't get mad. But I suspect you'll need protecting when things get bad. And this heat must be the best chance I've had to put my past behind me. So if you haven't guessed, I'm coming on your killer.
You know, this actually isn't the worst experience I've had riding a Greyhound. <laughs>
and sisters too. And then a wicked woman ruined my life. And ever since then it seems that no one wants to see me. Yeah, that's interesting. We're leaving now. Wait! Your eyes are quite unique, my dear. Really? Seriously, the detail work is amazing. They remind me of someone. Would you mind if I took your picture? I'd like to create a new statue. Of me? Oh, you deserve to be immortalized in stone forever. No, maybe we should get going. It's just one picture, Percy. It's like you can see every individual strand of fur. Why doesn't your friend get in, too? Yeah, I don't think so. Ooh, camera shy. A handsome young man like you. <laughs> I guess one picture can't hurt. Should I smile? Interesting choice to have him screaming. I think a natural reaction is best. Is anyone else hearing this thing sound? Yep, she really captured Uncle Ferdinand. Who's ready for their Criticize me all the time. <laughs> Look, I've studied, I've trained, I've I done everything that. to prove to the gods I'm the best, and you just show up and you, you don't even know how to hold a sword. Yes, I do. Ow! Ow! <laughs> hands here. I didn't ask for any of this, you know. Gods, quests, monsters. Oh, wow, that is a lot easier. Now come after me. With my sword. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're smart. You're brave. You are scary good with that knife. How could your mom not be proud of you? That's what I want to know. You know the only gift my mom ever gave me? A hat that makes you invisible. You put it on and no one can see you. Seemed appropriate. Always been a smart girl. Always made the grade, always got the gold star. Always been a smart girl. A smart girl only gets a girl so far. You win at every single game. You want a quest, they tell you tough. If you don't go, you'll never know. You'll ever be good. like to have 
feels good enough. Do you know how many times I've been kicked out of school? Yeah, but when boys screw up, they always get a second chance. I've always been a tough girl. Always been the one not to run from a fight. Always been a tough girl. Cause most girls never win if they're polite. To me, I tend to stay at my ground.
will strike us right out of the sky. Do we have enough chocolates for an Uber? We don't even have enough chocolates for a veggie burger. Yeah, well, if you can buy all those damn snacks. Oh, it was the Hoover, damn it! I was hungry. Burst. You saved yeah, money for damn snacks. Yeah, it's a ten dollar.
thief was there. He was talking about the bolt. Well, that must have been Hades. No, he wasn't at all. There was something in the pit. I told him to remember Talia. What? I haven't heard that name in a long time. You know who she is? She was my friend. I should have told you. I thought if I did, you'd never want me on this quest. If you knew what a failure I really am. Ask Annabeth. She knows. There's a tree on a hill up on Half Blood Hill that watches over us silent and still. And no one that can be safe until we can see the tree on the hill. This was way before I met you. Chiron sent me to escort three half-bloods back to camp. Two were runaways. One was Annabeth, the other was Luke, and the third was Talia. Tough girl. Like her dad. Zeus. I was the only kid in the big three. You are now! We'd almost made it back to camp, and I got nervous, and we got lost, and by the time we found the hill, something else found us. And there on the hill, on half blood hill, a cold, dark, and chill, the nothingness we She stayed to hold off the monsters. She paid for her sacrifice with her life. And that's when Zeus showed up and saved her. Right? It was too late for that. As she died, he turned her into a tree. So she could stand there protecting us forever the way I couldn't do for her. There's a tree on the hill, on half a hill, that protects us all. not true, Grover. I wouldn't be alive if it wasn't for you. Neither would Luke. You're awake? We're getting close to the underworld. Kind of hard to sleep. Guys, what if this is all a mistake? We've been so sure that Hades is the thief, but what if we're wrong? The Oracle told me I would fail. We're here. Are we sure we're ready to do this? Not at Let's go. <laughs> well, this must be it. T.O.A. Records. I kind of figured there'd be monsters. Yeah, we knew that the lobby to the underworld would be so... Okay. <laughs> Going down! That's K-Ron, the ferryman to the underworld. Um, we need to get to Hades. Well, you don't look dead. Read the sign. No soliciting. No loitering. No living! Oh, we are totally dead. Yeah, we uh, drowned in a bathtub. All three of us. Big bathtub. Passage across the River Sticks isn't free. With adults, I usually charge their credit card or add the ferry price to their last cable bill. But children never die prepared. Oh, go drown from us. You have a half blue. Is that a problem? No, not at all. My real 
real passion is music. Would you like to hear my demo? What's on that can hear you on that sweet ass riff? Security wing of the underworld. 
Well, what is so bad that the regular security wing isn't good enough? Chiron told you about how our parents went to war against their father. Well, first they overthrew him. Then they threw him into a pit. So you mean that that thing down there is Kronos? But that doesn't make any sense. Why would Kronos want my shoes? <laughs> they were really cool shoes. <laughs> Unless it wasn't the shoes it was after. What? You think you wanted my deodorant? <laughs> That's Vincent Bolt! What was it doing in my backpack? <gasps> uh, no, guys, no. I did not steal it, I swear. Well, then how did it get there? I don't know. How did you know where to find it? What? I didn't. It was a hypothesis. A, a guess. Stop looking at me like that. Betrayed by a friend. How bad did you need a quest anyway? Not that bad. Look, there's something weird going on. Someone is trying to pit the big three against each other. But it is not Hades. We've got to get out of here before he finds us. It's too late for that! <laughs> You're as rash as your father, son of Poseidon, from the looks of it, as stupid. Uh, you know where we are? Mm. And I know why you're here. You thought I was the bad guy. Everyone always thinks Hades is the bad guy! Maybe it's the decor, I don't know. <laughs> you were framed. So was I. If you let us go, we and why would I want to do that? Because you're super chill that way. One does not simply walk out of the underworld. That's the whole point of the underworld. Unless, unless what? You give me that bolt. Oh, I may not have stolen it, but. Since it's here. <laughs> what do the Trojans say? Never look a gift god level explosive in the mouth. Why would you want to start a war? <laughs> because when the gods go to war, it's the mortals who suffer. And then end up here. And I do get lonely. No chance. We came here to stop a war, not start one. Yeah, there's no way in hell that we... Oh. <laughs> we are handing this over to you. <laughs> Not even in exchange for her. Percy? Huh? Mom? She is merely a shade, but I can restore her. What has your father ever done for you? He doesn't care about his family. <laughs> or his brother. <laughs> Who he never visits. Oh no, he's too busy playing with his mermaids and his dolphins. <laughs> Act like he's so cool with his Hawaiian shirt. Did you say Hawaiian shirt? I can give you your freedom, your friends, and your mother. And all it'll cost is a little war. The choice is yours, son of Poseidon. I'll give you a moment to consider. <laughs> Since my good intentions always crash and burn and everything I tried to do will fail Never once will I prevail going wrong in
stay out of their children's lives. The most important choices are the ones you make for yourself. Still, 
I am sorry you were born. Wow. <laughs> Seriously? A hero's life is never easy. <laughs> Self sculpture kit. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. It's um, Medusa's head, so. <laughs> so now what? Well, I guess as my official protector, you can officially escort us back to camp. Aww, and you're conscious this time! <laughs> What do you do when the battle's won? So many questions left unanswered, so many things still left undone. What do you do when it's up to you to choose? Has something ended or begun? Stay or go, pick one. I got up here as soon as I heard. Oh, hail Perseus Jackson, hero of Olympus. Percy's alive? Hey, Clarice, we met your dad. He's not as tough as you. You met my dad? Did he mention me? Luke! Hey! Luke! Attention, campers! It's the last day of summer! If you intend to make me miserable year-round, please inform us by sundown. Otherwise, the cleaning harpies will eat anyone who remains! Perry Johansson, this means you! It is Percy Jackson! Yeah. I stay because it's safer back to the home I left behind. I can stay and train for this reaction. But what about peace of mind? Girl, what's my deal? Why do I feel there's something that they still need to find? Where do you go when it's over? What do you do when you've come to the last day of summer? Hey, it's a letter from your mom. And a photo of her new sculpture being dipped. <laughs> How come you never go home? I tried. Once my dad couldn't deal with all the monster attacks and my stepmom couldn't deal with me. It's just asking for trouble. Sometimes family is worth the trouble. Believe me. I guess we both have a choice to make. Seaweed brain. Big hero. Look, I've barely seen you since I got back. You've been avoiding me? Not at all. Tough last day. I thought after I finished my quest, everything would make sense, but it doesn't. I still don't know who is working with Ares, or what any of this has to do with Kronos. It's the last day of summer, and I just don't feel like anything is over. Yeah, I get it. My quest was supposed to be the biggest thing in my life. I came back changed. But the rest of camp was exactly the same. Chiron always says our parents make camp as a safe magic space. The truth, so they don't have to see us. They don't bother to show their face. It's time to make the world our own. Time someone put them in their place. Aristotle, we were starting a war between. 
between the gods. It's bigger than that. It's about wiping them out and taking our turn. You're the lightning thief. The Oracle warned you. Betrayed by a friend. You set me up! You told me to go to the underworld, and then you gave me those shoes to pull me into that pit, and you were trying to free Kronos. Why? You promised me the power to defeat our parents. He's using me to get back at the gods. Go ahead. I know you will choose wisely, Annabeth. You're right. It's over, Luther. It's not over yet. Well, it is for Percy. No! Oh! Oh, no! Go after him! He's at Rosa! It's the only thing that will heal him. gods and mortals. Now, I can't tell you what to do, but if you choose to stay, know that you'll have the full protection of the gods. No. Luke was right about one thing. Is that we cannot just hide at camp waiting for our parents to fix things. We have to do it ourselves. Out there. In the real world. Because that's where the monsters are. The gods will think we're impertinent. Oh. We are impertinent. <laughs>
Seems my good intentions always crash and burn. Everything I try to do will fail. Never once will I prevail. Going wrong at every turn. What belongs to the sea can always return. What belongs to the sea can always return. It's a seashell. No. It's a gift from a god. Maybe my dad was a screw up too. His best laid plans always falling through. Maybe he did the best that he could do. Maybe my dad wasn't always there. Maybe he never knew how to care. But hey, that's life and life ain't fair. And I know right now things are less than fine. But I think my dad may have thrown me 